Well, great, now I'm stuck. <laughs> I backed up to try to do a, a Yui so I didn't have to get in the, uh, this. the mud out here on the road, but it's just like concrete once you uh, get stuck in it. I should have walked out here, but it was too cold. So it's all the way down there. And then it's yeah, I'm stuck in know, the mud. As far as the eye can see, send help. It's just mud everywhere. Of course, this is a dirt road, but uh, it's the only way in and out of here for all these people. And uh, I was thinking, you know, somebody could come and get this water and suck it up in a pump and put it in the back of their truck for the summer when there isn't uh, a lot of water available, although that might not be a problem if you have a tank, but for those people that don't have a tank or access to water. So anyway, that's my idea. I'll show you some other water. I'm gonna go to the beach on Saturday and uh, there's a man-made lake over here where there's geese and ducks and I just think it would be kind of cool to uh, Put something together because uh, I'm all about water. I love water. I love to swim, and I need to, and I need a job. So why not work in something that you like? And then how does the saying goes? Do something you like, and you'll never work a day in your life. Okay, I have to go. It's freezing out here, and I gotta get my truck out of the mud before it gets dark. See ya. Bye. So here's a big water tank out in the uh, middle of the desert. And I was thinking that this is what I want to do somehow is to get water from the, uh, well, this is sucking up water from the aquifer underneath or the lake that's underneath this property. But I want to uh, provide, make, potable water for people who need to have their water trucked in because some of these places out here don't have access to water or the wells are running dry. I just wanted to, uh, I just wanted to uh, show you what a water tank looks like in case you don't know, but, but uh, that, this is part of my idea to make a desol plant out in the desert, so what do you think? Colin, what do you think? I think you have a computer science degree, right? And uh, I'm thinking of, uh, I need an app or a video presentation or a video game or something to get me started, like a kick in the pants.
it on my uh, Spider-Man sunglasses. So, I'm at the beach. Nobody around. You can hear the traffic going down. Oh, what's the name of the street? Vista Del Mar. I don't know. But before I show you the beach and prove it, I have to keep an eye on my truck because I'm technically parked in the red. But, um, so, if, um, I'm only 100 miles from the beach, and the freeway goes right through town, we have electric buses, electric trucks, and if I drove to the ocean to fill up barrels of water and drove them back, and filled up the tank, I could, how many, how much water do I need to get to sustain my house with, oh, half a dozen or a dozen pine trees and uh, landscaping and maybe a garden if I want to do that. So I would, desol it, filter off, out the salt water and any other wastewater that I found. Uh, even if I had a, a well that I could dig, that water can't be all that clean. So, how many tanks? One tank for the salt water, one tank for the fresh water, and then irrigation pipes. How many trips to the ocean? <laughs> so the effort is to maintain the water at my house or anybody's house in the event it never rains or you're in a drought for many years. Easy breezy. It's a beautiful day here at the beach. It's Sunday. No, it's Saturday after Thanksgiving, the last Saturday of the of the year, of the decade, I just heard on the radio. So that makes it the 25th, 6th, 7th, 8th, the 28th of December 2019. And I was hoping a big plane was going to take off right behind my head here for an added effect, but I guess it's not going to happen. This is a little... Uh, Kitty Park with not very much parking on, I think it's Vista Del Rey, uh, right next to the ocean. I'm going to, I'm going to prove it right now. See? There's a garbage can. And palm tree. And my truck's right there. So, I, I don't know if I need an app or a video game as a presentation, but because I really don't want to do a business plan, but I will if I have to, because 2020 is the year I'm going to start a business in making water and <clears throat> making water and, hey, I just haven't found a friend right here, look. No? and um, put together some kind of a prefab house that I because I need a place to stay I need a place to live and then I can see how it works at my place before I try to sell it online to the rest of the world okay that's it for now happy new year here's another look at the ocean See, there's a plane right there, taking off. So you get one. <laughs> oh cool, look at 
of the palm trees. So, story problem. How many trips to the ocean in, uh, and how big of a tank to help sustain water at my house on, see if I can get two and a half acres. And I want to grow pine trees or that tree, medicinal trees, like the one they grow in Africa that helps uh, men with their prostate, but uh, nobody can get to the trees because apparently there's a civil war there. I don't know, but we have to plant some trees and take care of them and, and other perennial bushes. And I want to be able to sprinkle, irrigate the whole place and sprinkle the house, prevent it from being, you know, in forest fires or whatever. So that's the plan, Stan. Thanks for listening. Uh, talk to you guys later. Ooh, there's another plan. Look at that one. Check that one out. That's what your plane looks like, Colin, when you took off and went back to you know where. Beautiful day at the beach. <laughs> there it goes. <laughs>